Welcome to ViewTheRace.com. This is the Run to Remember Los Angeles Half Marathon from Los Angeles, California. The race starts at the Grove and quickly takes a right onto Beverly Boulevard. Now the Run to Remember Los Angeles is a sister race to Boston's Run to Remember, which is always held on Memorial Day weekend. This race will be held in February, so weather should be incredible for this event. Now this course features a mostly out and back course, which the first half of this course is gradually uphill, and the second half of this course is gradually downhill. So certainly in a race such as this, a half marathon, you definitely want to start out well within your pace and make sure you don't go out too fast so you can take advantage of the downhill second half of this race. Now both the Los Angeles and Boston Run to Remember races are dedicated as tributes to fallen law enforcement officers and our first responders. So not only come out and enjoy a great event, but also support a great cause. Now at this point we're going to turn left into Paramount Studios. So runners will have the tremendous opportunity to run through Paramount Studios. They'll run through the double iconic gates. And runners will run through a gauntlet of new and vintage police and fire apparatus. Along with a tribute to the first responders we have lost in the line of duty. Runners will then exit the, through the single iconic gate where the 10k runners will return to the Grove and the half marathoners will continue on with the race. Now running through Paramount Studios is certainly one of those rare opportunities that runners get to do things that you would never be able to do normally. So quite a highlight of this event. We cross through mile four. Now again, if the half marathon distance is just a little bit too long for you, this race also does feature a 10K which turns around right after Paramount Studios. So even if you run the 10K, you'll still have the opportunity to run through Paramount as we continue on famous Hollywood Boulevard. I'm gonna take a right into Bonsdale Park and we're quickly just gonna work our way through this park and then head back out the way we came. We're just gonna circle through this park and then head left and head back on Hollywood Boulevard. Now at this point in the race, the road's gonna start to gradually be going downhill. So hopefully you still have some zip in your legs. You can start to take advantage of the slight downhill. We take a left on Western Avenue. Cross through mile seven. Now stay to the left side of the road. We'll be taking a left onto Melrose Avenue. Now this is just a very short out and back section of the course. We're just going to do a U-turn, and we're going to head back the way we came on Melrose. Across through mile nine. Now as we cross through mile 10, if you have anything left in your legs, hopefully you can pick it up just a little bit. As we take this left on La Brea Avenue, and continue to head back towards the Grove. Not too far now as we cross through mile 11. Now we're actually gonna run by Beverly Boulevard and stay in La Brea for just a brief time. And we're just gonna turn around, head back the way we came and head back towards Beverly Boulevard. We're gonna cross through mile 12 and then take a left on the Beverly Boulevard as we continue to head back towards the Grove. Under a mile now, if you have anything left in your legs, you really wanna kick it in at this point. As pretty soon you'll be taking a left on the Grove Drive and sprint to the finish. Thank you for viewing the race at viewtherace.com.